Hi, it's um, Steve Cook here and here we are on location in the luxury furniture factory, the last of its kind. I'm very grateful to the owners and the family here for uh, an amazing day and we've just wrapped working for the USA. Hard for the working man. Sorry, it's la, I'm sorry. La, 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 la. I'm sorry, it's so complicated. Steve Stevens, I play drums. My name's Marty and I'm a friend of Steve and I'm an actor. Um, and Steve's put his time in. Um, he's a remarkable vocalist, a terrific songwriter. Absolutely. Yeah, um, and you know, you, you see him staying with it. He, talk about a working man. I'm here to support him because he's finally getting accepted on, you know, his creative output, and it's remarkable. Uh, how did each of you get involved in this project today? For me, uh, I was playing with uh, a guy named Phil Susan, who was the bass player and writer for Ozzy Osbourne. And um, Steve happened to be in the audience when I was playing, and we just kind of hit it off and, you know, just decided to start working together. <laughs> these people I know. Um, <laughs> they were like What's your name? Where are you from? Hi, my name's Laura Wilde and I'm from Melbourne, Australia. My name is Jeff Coleman. I am from Los Angeles, California. Born and raised in Toledo, Ohio. What are you doing today with us? Well, we're here shooting the new music video for Working for the USA by Steve Cooks. She's playing the guitar, I'm pulling the shapes. Basically, He's actually the first guitarist, <laughs> yeah. second guitarist. So you've, you know, got the battle going on. Right. It's going to be like the war of the He's going to be like standing in front of me with a spotlight <laughs> on him. And I'm going to be in the background like Quasimodo. Just like, you know. <laughs> for the USA, for the U What's your name? Where are you from? My name's Mark Ryan from Doncaster in Yorkshire. Uh, lived in London for 20 years now, been living in California and Los Angeles for 15 years. How did you get involved with this project? I'm a guest host and um, the radio show called Combat Radio and LA Talk Radio. It's one of the biggest uh, shows that LA Talk Radio does in fact. I think we have like 800,000 listeners in California and 1.5 worldwide in 35 countries. And Steve came in to um, talk about this this project this is some weeks ago and I went to see him play live at a little venue in Santa Monica and was just just impressed both with him as a, as a person and and with the song and what he meant you know what the lyrics meant and what the heart of the song was about so I said if anything I can do let me know they gave Marcus the good apron and you got the shabby apron. I see your turn. You tell me what. When you see the radio sliding in here, just yell to me. Okay? Please no accent. You gotta stand here. I don't understand. I don't understand. Next to a big furniture oven. I don't know if you get more working class than that. I don't know that it's any different from being a British worker, but uh, it, it, feels, it feels the same. The last, not nice. With la la, with Tom. Tom. Bloody luxury. When I was a lad, we lived in paper bag and millet roads. We'd get up every morning and clean road with homes. 